Right, what's the best experience you've had with the guy hitting on you? The best experience I've had with a guy hitting on me. Honestly, if a man will just come up to me and be straight up, 100% honest, not too flirty, not too pushy, just having a genuine conversation with me, wants to speak, wants to pick my brain, has a question about me, and there's not a specific line you have to say, it's just kind of like the energy I feel from you and if you're really being a genuine person, not necessarily, you know, kind of pushing it with your dick or pushing, you know, sexuality, you know what I mean? Right, right. Okay. <laughs> I understand that. Um, nah, I kind of like it when guys just get to the punch. Yeah. Straight to the punch? Yeah. So you like straightforward? Yeah. yeah. So if you don't met sugar, yeah. Don't come off like, I don't know. Like a little girl about it. Yeah. Um, I guess like when they're, you know, not corny, like they don't yeah. have anything corny, like, I don't know. So what's, genuine. what's not, oh, yeah, something genuine? Yeah, they're very genuine yeah. and like real, like authentic, like they just approach not just, you and talk yo, to you. Yo, let me get your number. Yeah. Would, you, would you rather them get straight to the point or no? You'd rather them to just play around a little bit? they should sugarcoat it. Yeah. yeah. Sugarcoat it? You know, it? like smooth your way into yeah. it. Don't just, right. hey, can I get your number? Because I'm just going to, no. <laughs> Something cheesy? I can't think of anything. Anything that makes you smile. Because every guy is an asshole and they go, hey yo, you with the ass. Let me get your number. <laughs> wow. Yeah, just something casual. Just like, like what's your name, what's your number? Yeah. Yeah, so that you always fall for that? Like what's casual. the best one? Like what was the one that, that had you blown away to the point where you just you still remember it? Uh, <laughs> no, I don't know if there's ever been a good time. The best approach I had? Yeah, just in life period. Like, what was the best approach that you still remember because it was like, oh, it wowed you? Damn, these are okay. Can you brief me? I need to think about these questions. So long. I know. Hold on. Damn. Damn, I haven't been around a good guy like that. Like, <laughs> wow. I feel like in Miami, I can't find a good guy that was worth remembering. Something, a guy coming up to me and saying something other, something to me other than something sexual. It's a compliment. Fine compliment, like. All right. So the first question is. What's the best approach you've experienced with the guy hitting on you? Asking your name and like, you know, starting a conversation. Like, where are you from? Yeah, uh, my question. Not just like, shoulder. hey, little mama. Wait, no. no. So the first question that you just missed was, what's the best approach you've experienced with a guy hitting on you? Hi, how are you? What's, hey, your, name? Like, what's your name? Respectful. Not hey, like, what's up, Ray? What's up, Ray? Hey, hey mom. Quick and be funny. Yes. Quick and funny. Quick and funny. Yeah. Don't give me no yo ma what's your name? Nah. Uh, no. Yo ma where you from? Nah. Make me laugh. I feel and like I, so <laughs> you, you feel a little offended? Is that what that is? <laughs> uh, he came up to me and instead of like saying, hey, where you're going? What are you doing tonight? He was just like, you are so beautiful. He told me what was beautiful about me. Which was like what? Details. He told me my eyes were very pretty. Right. So, so the first question was, what's the best approach you experienced when a guy hit me? And a lot of girls was contradicting. Some of them said they wanted you to be straightforward, while some of them said they wanted you to sugarcoat it. So I guess it's all about the girl you actually approach. Um, most girls said they didn't want corny, but some girls said they liked fun, cheesy funny. I mean, um, but most of all, just be genuine, have a casual conversation, and just bring good energy. So what's what's the worst experience you? Worst experience? I mean, there's everything. People grabbing you, people, I mean, there's whistling at you, barking at you, whatever. You name it, it's happened. And that's, it just doesn't work out like that. And I don't know if they're just doing it to have fun, if they think it's funny. Or if they or, think they're actually gonna... You know, if they think it's actually gonna happen that way, I don't know. But it's too much. Okay. Hey, yo, with the ass. Let me get your number. So that's... Oh, you don't want to talk to me? Oh, fuck you, then, You were ugly anyway. Oh. I don't like being called baby, mom. Yeah. So anytime a guy's in the car, it's a bad approach. Yeah, yeah, like yelling for the car, driving by you. Yeah. So you would, you'd rather them actually get out and just walk up and talk to you? Yeah, yes. I think when you're dead, like in a circle, and they just come up behind you and just grab you, yeah. and that's just so. Like, I think that's really fine. So what if you were in a circle and they came up behind you and didn't grab you and just wanted to talk to you? Would that still not be appropriate? I mean, it would, but like the vibe of that is not somewhere to have a conversation. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay.
Yeah, or like he was not gonna get a date. Yeah. Gross. Touching me in any way, shape, or form. Touching you. For sure. Let's drop her. Somebody's scared. If you're scared, somebody asked me the other day, yo, do you think I'm ugly? Oh my scared? god. And I was that like, was so bad. Do you think I'm ugly? He's oh, like, yo, know. serious question, do you think I'm ugly? And I was like, ah. Uh, I walked away. I was like, I'm a Oh my god, this guy came up to me and was just like, what did that guy say? He came up to me and was like, uh, you trying to spin in the, it's like you trying to come to my hotel or something? I don't even know what he said, he said some crazy stuff. Okay. Alright, so the second question was, what's the worst experience you've had with the guy hitting on you? And a lot of girls said the touching, they don't like touching. Some guys come up to him and touch him and they don't like that shit. Um, whistling is another thing that they don't like. They don't like, they don't like for you to call him baby, they don't like for you to call him bae. I don't like for you to call him Ma. I mean, that's kind of common sense, but I guess. Um, a lot of girls said that one thing they hated was when guys yell out the car. But I mean, if you're driving or if you're a passenger, then how else would you get their attention? Uh, most girls said they'd actually want you to park the car, get out, and then come and approach them like a gentleman. Most girls said they don't like scary guys either. They need you to be confident. Like, they don't want to. The girls can smell fear. Like, they know when you're scared. So just man up. Be confident, and you're probably a bad dude. So what, what do you like to hear? Yes. Oh, let's see. What do I like to hear? Um, it's not necessarily about the words for me, though. I'm not like, I mean, I've, you can hear, oh, you're so beautiful. You can hear, oh, you're so fantastic. Whatever you want to say. Actually, I can tell you one of my favorite compliments I've ever had. You want to, you want to hear? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> I have, someone's come up to me, and it's an older gentleman, and he said, you are a portrait of beauty. And I said, wow, I've never heard that. If you say something different, if you say something new that's never been said before, obviously that's going to grab my attention. Right. Uh -huh. Okay, so what's a good approach for him to actually try and get your attention? Hi, hi, how are you? I saw you across the street, like... Blase, blase. Yeah. So like don't the, go straight for the number. Should he go for the Instagram first, or like, what do you no, what do you the suggest? Number. The number. Straight for the number. Yeah. I want to get to know you. Can I have your number? Like that. So the. What's What's your? I don't even know. Like, ask me a question. Like, Intentions of wanting to get to know them, then that's the most crucial part. It's the crucial part? For sure. Okay. The truth. The truth? Some shit that's gonna make you smile. Okay. Make you laugh. Okay. No, yeah. no. What about you? What do you like to hear? Yeah. I mean, I just like someone to be honest and genuine. Like, not cocky. You know, like cocky. Like no cocky. cocky. I mean, a compliment would be yeah. nice, you know? A compliment. But and then, they just get compliments all the time, so is that all? I mean, it depends what compliment it is. You know, if you say something like, wow, you're really beautiful, that's nice to hear. But if you're like, wow, you're you got a... You're super sexy, like... Yeah, or you got a big butt, <laughs> like, that's not... I like to just hear, hi, how, how you doing? How are you? Are you? Like how a regular what's your name? name? Are you enjoying so -so? spring break? Are you from here? Like My that. name is so-and-so, so -so. nice to meet you. What do you mean? Like, what do you like to hear? What would I you? Like, I like for somebody to approach me. Just be, to, re just to approach me like a regular person, respectfully, like. because I have worked very hard to yeah. put on a respectful front. Exactly. I don't think you have to try to talk to me. Just if he doesn't know me, you, then he's gonna have to try and talk to you. With your, with your humor and your, and we'll see. So a new guy that never met you before. If How you're attractive. If you're attractive, I can approach you. You don't gotta approach me. Oh, really? Le gustó, le gustó. Um, I want to hear long term. Like, are you gonna take me somewhere? Are we gonna do something? Are we gonna get to know each other? Not, hey, come back with me, or hey, I come with you. You know. Not about that way. We can jump right into the physical. That's too much. So the third question was, what do you like to hear? Like, they just want you to say something unique, you know? They want you to say something different, something not just a regular pickup line that, that you've heard a million times. Pick up your own shit. Uh, another thing, girls want you to ask them questions with substance. And they want you to just ask them, like, hey, baby, um, what's your name, what's your number? They want you to ask them things like, you know, what school do you go to? Um, what do you do for work? Where do you see yourself in the future? Well, at least that's what they told me. 
lot of them said they just wanted you to be truthful. The truth, honest, and funny. And you pretty much got them.